He is a self-described actor and environmental activist, and his documentary, The Eleventh Hour, is highly focused on the issue of global warming and other ecological concerns. Leonardo DiCaprio has also teamed up with fellow environmental crusader and former vice president Al Gore to help raise awareness about global warming. The Leonardo DiCaprio Foundation has actively fostered awareness of environmental issues since it was established in 1998. DiCaprio's goal is to secure a sustainable future for our planet. This was to give scientists, great thinkers, professors, people who have devoted their life to this subject matter, uh, a pulpit in which to speak freely and openly about how they viewed the conditions of our planet. And DiCaprio sees his role as an actor, the perfect platform for getting environmental issues across. You look back to the peace movement or the civil rights movement, there have been people in the entertainment industry that have been in the forefront of that. and and. To be a part of this generation talking about issues like uh, global warming or what's going on in Africa, there is a tremendous amount of people, there are a tremendous amount of people be, that are very outspoken and, and I, uh, there should be no apologies for that. And in the fickle world of Hollywood, DiCaprio seems to be a genuinely committed environmentalist, receiving praise from environmental groups for opting to fly on commercial flights instead of chartering private jets. We're all here to keep the pressure on our politicians and our corporations to recognize the drastic implications of global warming. The word warming sounds almost inviting. Then in a world 20 years from now, we will all be living in a tropical paradise where the extent of our problems will be pondering which SPF sunscreen to use. But don't be fooled by semantics. Thousands of climate scientists agree that global warming is not only the most threatening environmental problem, but one of the greatest challenges facing all of humanity. DiCaprio has said he feels that recent hurricanes and tsunamis are just a terrifying warning of what is to come. As a Natural Resources Defense Council trustee, he is spreading a message that the world needs cleaner, more sensible energy choices and a simple commitment to environmental stewardship. He drives a hybrid car. His house has solar panels and his actions have inspired other celebrities. Leonardo DiCaprio seems to be putting his money where his mouth is, investing time and funds into solving the climate crisis. I drove here today in my hybrid vehicle that gets 50 miles to the gallon and has less than half of the pollution of a normal car. The technology to make safer, cleaner cars and SUVs is here today. Pollution-free renewable energy sources from wind and solar power are also available today. The environmental age is here. Let's reduce our dependency on oil, foreign and domestic. Let's develop a global politics that accelerates the transition to clean fuels and sustainable energy from renewable sources. DiCaprio also has lobbied hard for universal access to clean water and for reducing fossil fuel emissions and other greenhouse gases worldwide. The Hollywood star even sent out a message about global warming at the Cannes Film Festival, controversially warning that human beings face extinction as a result of the environmental crisis. Alongside his acting career, Leonardo DiCaprio has had a lifelong passion for environmental awareness that seems to drive him to invest his fame and fortune towards fostering a sustainable global future. A tireless promoter of green causes and events, Leonardo has said, it's not just global warming, it's not just a loss of biodiversity, it's not just the pollution of our oceans and the clearing of our rainforests and all these complicated systems. We need to inspire a personal transformation, an environmental consciousness for this generation to implement a lot of these changes that need to occur.